Hello everyone. Today we'll uh, learn about the structure basicity relationship of uh, aryl amines and ammonia. So here we will see that uh, aryl amines uh, in this amine is attached to benzene ring. So the lone pair of electrons on the nitrogen atom is in conjugation with the benzene ring. Hence it is not available for or it is less available for protonation. So therefore their basicity decreases and its pKb value is very high. Uh, uh, pKb value is high that, that also means that its basicity is very less. Now we will see that uh, the, uh, the resonating structures of aryl amines uh, it will show that it is very stable but uh, compared to the uh, resonating structures of anilium ion. So uh, when the resonating structures or the resonance ability uh, of aryl amine is high, therefore its stability is high and it will not uh, easily protonate or it will not accept the proton and hence the basicity decreases. So let us see the resonating structure of aryl amine or aniline. So, uh, this is the aniline, the lone pair on nitrogen atom will shift here and this will shift here. So the next structure will be NH2 plus, here double bond will come, here negative charge. Then again this will shift here and this will go here and you will see one more resonating structure like this and then what will happen that this will come here and this bond will shift here. So one more reson resonating structure of aniline. Here negative charge will come, here double bond, here double bond and this will now shift here, this negative uh, charge and this will come here. So you will get your aniline ion, aniline molecule again like this. So you can see that there are 5 resonating structures of aniline. Right? So this uh, shows that it is very stable ion, uh, stable molecule. So uh, if we compare it to the anilium ion, when it accepts the proton, then what, uh, how many resonating structure will it have? So it will have only two resonating structures, right? So for example, here I am showing, so this is res uh, anilium ion right so this is the first resonating structure of anilium ion and this is the this is the second uh, resonating structure of anilium ion so you you can see uh, that there are only two uh, resonating ions of uh, resonating um, structures of anilium ion Hence, it is less stable than aniline or aryl amine molecule. Um, based on this, we can infer that this molecule will not read, readily accept proton to become this ion and hence its basicity is less as compared to um, uh, alkyl amines and ammonia. Right? So, this we have inferred. One more thing, if we add um, electron donating groups like OCH3 or methyl groups right so it will uh, increase the basicity because they will release electrons um, and uh, towards this ion and uh, therefore the basicity um, increases it will uh, release electrons towards the nitrogen atom and uh, it will readily accept the proton right uh, and if you add uh, electron withdrawing group to the aniline, then what will happen? Uh, like electron withdrawing group, like uh, your uh, 
क्लोरोफ्लोरो ग्रुप्स और योर ओ एच ग्रुप राइट सो दिस विल डिक्रीज द बेसिलिटी ऑफ एनिलीन और एराइल अमीन बिकॉज दे विल पुल द इलेक्ट्रॉन्स फ्रॉम द नाइट्रोजन आइटम एंड हैंस इट विल नॉट बी प्रोटोनेटेड राइट सो इन दिस वे वी कैन डिस्कस द बेसिसिटी स्ट्रक्चर रिलेशनशिप ऑफ एराइल अमीन so uh, one more thing this is not oh electron withdrawing group is carboxylic acid right so it will decrease the basicity of aralamines uh, now we will see one example uh, that how to solve a uh, example based on the information or knowledge we have gained right so this is the question that uh, arrange these molecules in decreasing basicity order so there are four molecules uh, first is aniline then it is uh, amine uh, ethane amine then it is diethylamine and this then ammonia right so uh, first of all the maximum basicity will be of this molecule c2h5 whole twice nh why because it has two alkyl groups two ethyl groups attached to the nitrogen atom hence they will release electrons towards the nitrogen atom and uh, there will be more inductive effect and when there will be more electron density on nitrogen atom then it will get easily protonated and accept proton that means it will get that it will accept proton and its basicity will be high so first of all the highest basicity is of c2h5 whole twice nh diethylamine then second will be the uh, ethanamine why because uh, it have also uh, the alkyl group one alkyl group attached to the nh2 that is amine and it will also uh, release electrons towards the nitrogen atom hence it will get easily protonated and its basicity will be high so the second will be c2h5 nh2 third will be ammonia right so third will be ammonia here and then the least will be uh, c6h5 nh2 why because here the lone pair of electrons on nitrogen atom will be in conjugation with the benzene ring as we have discussed just now so it will not be available or less available for protonation and hence it will uh, not easily accept proton and its basicity will be least least and uh, even less than ammonia so the least will be c6h5 nh2 that is aniline so this is the decreasing order of basicity of these molecules so in this way we can solve the questions based on the uh, this topic right so i hope you have understood this topic thank you